Hi there, it's Vicki McCarthy from Aussie Stampers. Thank you very much for joining me again today. Welcome back to my series, Retiring Favourites, where I'm showing you my favourite items that are retiring, just so that you have a chance to hop over and have a look at them before they go, if you decide you would like to purchase them. Now this card here is made using a retiring stamp set, Sweetbriar Rose. And it's a wood mount stamp set and it will be retiring. It's really good for colouring. So if you love water colouring or colouring with coloured pencils or as I do, Copic markers, then this is a great stamp set for you to choose. You can see I've completed a card using my Copic markers here and I have put a little detail of the leaves, the flowers, the stamen and the shadow and all the colours that I used. I am an intermediate certified Copic designer so I have trained in how to use Copics to get a blended technique like this and I actually run Copic colouring classes as a part of what I do in my home studio using the Stampin' Up! stamps. Now this is not the only stamp that is a colouring stamp that is retiring. In fact, there's a whole two pages of them in the middle here in the water colouring section. Each one of these stamps will be going. So in this together will be retiring. Perfect Peacock will be retiring. Vivid Vases will be retiring. Blended Bloom will be retiring. This is absolutely fun to do colouring with this one. This is one of my favourites as well. And of course Sweetbriar Rose will be retiring. So if you love water colouring just go and check out the stamp sets on page 114, 115 and have a look at them over in the store. See if they are discounted. It'll be your chance to snap them up before they're gone. I just want to show you another card that I made using Sweetbriar Rose. And in fact I framed this card so now we've gone from this colourway to this one. So I'll just swap that over there using the blue violets, yellows, whites and greens. And this one I put into a frame and I matched it up with the Stampin' Up! cardstock, the Wisteria Wonder and the Old Olive. And the other card that I did initially I matched up with Melon Mumbo and Old Olive again to form the card. So if you love colouring, I suggest you snap up Sweetbriar Rose before it's gone or some of the other watercolouring stamps that are going. And join me again tomorrow for another in the series of retiring favourites where I show you some techniques that you may not have used before, something a little bit different to do with your stamps and with your crafting. So I'll see you then. Bye for now.